So I was just using my Android TV like any other day, scrolling, relaxing until I needed a streaming app. I opened the Play Store and boom, something went wrong. Check your Wi-Fi. But here's the thing. My internet was working perfectly. I tapped try again once, twice, ten times. Nothing. And that's when I knew something deeper was broken. So I went deep and I figured it out. Hit subscribe for more tech videos. Whoa. The first solution is to clear the cache of the critical components of Google Play Store. Go to Settings, Apps, then see all apps, then find Google Play Services and clear both data and cache. Repeat the same steps for Google Services Framework and Google Play Store. After clearing all caches, restart your TV. Important to note that do not open the Play Store immediately after restarting. If you do and the error appears again, you will need to repeat the entire process. In the second step, we will manually update the essential Google components. To do this, Open your TV's built-in web browser and go to website apkmirror.com. Alternatively, you can download the required files on your desktop or laptop and then transfer them to your TV using a USB drive. Using your TV remote, navigate to the search bar on the APK Mirror website and type Google Play Services Android TV. You can also use a USB mouse or keyboard for easier typing. For the search results, look for version 25.24, designed for Android TV, and select it. On the next page, scroll down to find the latest file and press the OK button to open it. Then, on the following page, Select the Download APK button. Wait for the APK file to download. Then open and install it. After the installation is complete, go back to the same website using your TV web browser. This time, search for Google Services Framework. Since my Android TV is running Android 9 Pie, I will search specifically for Google Services Framework 9. Select the correct file, download the APK, and install it the same way we did earlier. For the final step, search, download, and install the APK file for Google Account Manager version 6.0. This version may vary depending on your Google or Android TV version. So make sure to check your Android version in the TV's About setting. Once all the APK files have been installed, go to Settings and restart your TV. Once your TV is back on, head over to the Play Store and give it a try. And just like that, boom, the Play Store is alive again. No more something went wrong drama. This problem won't come back to haunt you even if you restart or turn off your TV. Now you're free to download all your favorite apps and games without a worry in the world. If this video helped you, smash that like button and don't forget to subscribe for more awesome tech fixes. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.